Howdy y'all, it's your host Rogue. Welcome back to Love It Games. We're continuing our Tales of Siphonia, Siphonia journey today, so I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We're gonna hop right back in, and uh, we already got a little cutscene mission with um, the game, so let's get right to it. Betrayer Kratos. Kratos has been deceiving us from the beginning. I had thought that there was something strange about him, but in the end, I couldn't figure it out in time. I hate myself for being so naive. Damn him. He'll pay for this, I swear. Lloyd. Alright. Don't want to go down there. Hey, is this a machine? Yes, it is. Alright, that looks good. Um... Eudrastiel's aim. I wonder if that Eudrastiel guy is the leader of Crucius. He already, we already know that. Yes, most likely the sleeping goddess Martell is a symbol symbolic entity. While Eudrastiel actually executes their plans. And Kratos is really one of Eudrastiel's subordinates. What is he trying to do by turning Clut into Martell? More importantly than that, I want to know why Martell requires a body to be her vessel. Alright, in other words, that means she doesn't have a body. Wait, if you don't have a body, is all you have left is your heart? Can you still live? Bella is currently living despite having lost her heart. Perhaps the opposite as well is possible as well. Suppose when you put it that way. If we could find out why Martell lost her body, we might be able to find out wh what it is that Eudrasiel is trying to do. Alright, so we can do electricity, nothing up here. Something here? What is this? Alright, so there's two chests. Do that again. This time we'll go this way. Alright, so that is not a thing. What is it we are looking for? Push it down. I'm assuming this goes here, I don't know. The stairs down. I needed that crap. I didn't realize that was the only way. Don't tell me it's 
This is why it had you saved before you came in. Yeah, alright. We just read this, so I'm not reading it again. Nice cold glass of milk. Come on, guys. What sucks is you have to literally bring everything over here, then bring it back over here. Because you have to have all three. So you're moving this across this entire room like twice. If you want to get these two chests, that is. I didn't realize that when we first were doing this. That old zombified Kled over here doing all the hard work. Straw hat, level 2 gem. So it wasn't really worth it. But oh well. Gonna save it. Go down. Insufficient power, please charge. Nothing else over here. Energy charge confirmed. Push the switch. No. Does this go down there? I'm assuming it does. more to this. There's definitely more to this. Crap. That's back over here. I have no way of moving this over. There's like a wall here. Yeah. I can see that there's a switch there, but that does me no good.
Oh wait. Put that down. What's this do up here? Okay. So I need to put the things back on there vertically. That makes more sense. Wooden crates. Didn't realize it was the same thing. Gotta use your noggin. Then charge, push the thing. Hopefully that's the right one. Push the switch, yes. What does this other power thing do? Ah, oh, I would have missed that protect ring. Yeah, I think that's everything. Damn it! What's so special about me? Those renegades need to hurry up and make up their freaking minds about whether they're our enemies or not. Lloyd, what are we going to do now? We've got to save Colette somehow. She's going to die if she's made into Martell's vessel. But what can we do? Sheena, where did you get your X-Sphere? Huh? Well, that came out of nowhere. I got this before I came here. They attached it to me at the Imperial Research Academy. Is it normal for people to equip X-Spheres in Teveala? No, not at all. The technology was originally brought over by the Renegades. Nowadays, X-Spheres are mainly attached to machines. Wait a second. So Tetheala and the Renegades are on the same side? I'm not sure if you could say that, but the Renegades were the ones that brought us information about the nature of the two worlds, and the plan to assassinate the Chosen was their idea. They talked the King and the Pope into it. If you desire for Tetheala to prosper, kill the Chosen of Silverant. That's horrible! Lloyd, I suggest we go to Tetheala. Why Tetheala? Don't you remember what Ewan said? Angels are half-elves that evolved using special X-spheres called Crucius Crystals. Oh, I get it. Colette's current condition is caused by the Crucius Crystal. Since Tetheala is studying the X-spheres, they may know something about Crucius Crystals as well. That's a good idea. I'm pretty sure that they're studying the Crucius Crystal that belongs to Tetheala's Chosen, at the Imperial Research Academy. There's a Chosen in Tetheala too? Of course. The World Regeneration Ritual is carried out in Tetheala as well. The Church of Martell exists too. But if they've been carrying out the regeneration that many times, why hasn't Martell's vessel been completed already? I'm curious about that myself. Perhaps those corpses lined up in the Tower of Salvation were... No, never mind. Yeah, there are too many things that we don't know. Crucius's objective, the Renegades, the method to save Colette. So let's just start with what we can do now. So, we're going to Tetheala? Yeah. That's the only lead we have right now. And this time, I'm going to fulfill my role. I'm not going to let Colette bear the burden all by herself anymore. Wait a minute. That's great and all, but how are we going to get to Tetheala? I'm sure Sheena knows how to get there, correct? My understanding is that you can travel to Tetheala by passing through a distortion in space. As far as I know, crafts called Riards are the only things that can do that. Where are they? The Renegades should have them. They should be somewhere on this base. Okay then, let's get going.
All right, so we just came back in here. I don't know. All right, so this came from down here. So these are the Riards. Hurry, they'll catch up to us. All right then, Tetheola, here we come. Just suddenly... Look, the fuel gauge is empty. So that's it. Since you've broken the seals in Silverant, there's not enough mana in this world. And that means... We're gonna fall! Ah! I think we managed to avoid destroying them completely. But they're useless unless we get some fuel. What's the fuel? Coal? Coal? Oh, jeez. How do you guys manage to actually live in Silverant? Then magic, I assume. Perhaps the lightning that Volt produces? Then all we have to do is have Sheena summon Volt, right? I haven't made a pact with Volt. Oh. Well, then I guess we'll just have to leave these here. Oh, and here I thought Magi technology was infallible. Hey, what's that? That's the Tower of Salvation. Why is that here? This is Tefeala, right? Of course. The Tower of Salvation appears in the Flourishing World. The Tower also appeared on your side after Colette received the Oracle, right? Two worlds. Two towers. What about the Holy Ground? The Church of Martell is also over here, correct? Is the holy ground called Carlon? Yes. The place where the Tower of Salvation lies is the holy ground of Carlon. The same is in your world. The holy ground of Carlon is where the peace treaty was signed to end the ancient war. There can't be two of them. Are you sure yours isn't a fake? We have records in our museums that depict how the hero Mythos called the two ancient kings to the holy ground of Carlon in order to forge a peace treaty. And such records exist on our side as well. Instruments used to sign the treaty can be found in the Palma Costa Academy. So, either one side is fake, or maybe they're actually both real. Lloyd, that's not possible. Don't get mad, I was just kind of saying stuff. Anyway, let's get going. It's true we aren't going to get anywhere by pondering about it here. Wow, it's our first adventure in Tetheala. Genus, this isn't a field trip. I gotta say, that was quite a surprise. Indeed, you don't get the opportunity to fly through the sky very often. Or fall from the sky either. It can't be helped. When you break the seals in Silverant, the man over here grows thin. Even so, it's still a lot thicker over here than in Silverant. Oh, you can tell that. Of course, Genus and Professor are elves. Why can elves tell that? Well, because they're elves. Not quite how you land. 
So you are in Tepeala, we're doing a new save. I'm a hypocrite. Hey Colette, Colette, can you hear me? Still looks like you can't, she can't even tell you're talking to her right now. Damn it, at the moment facing the decision between Colette and the world for a split second, I chose the world. Even though it's nothing but a false peace. It is unavoidable when a single decision you make could destroy the world. Casually choosing your friend's life instead would have been a strange choice indeed. Still at the moment, I abandoned Colette. I'm a hypocrite. Damn it. We need to wash Lloyd's mouth out with some soap. We are in Tetheala. This is gonna be a piece. Round Dasher. And we're gonna have you inspect. Understood. Below. You don't. Ready? Tet they see. I'll take a closer look. Tet this beast. Ready? Tet they see. No way. Understood. Infinite powers. Tet the sea. Me thy strength. Meteor storm. I'll take a closer look. Ready? Tet the sea. Too bad. Fine pellet time! And we gained extra XP. And additional gold. And made a beef stew. A few more beef stews. There's no way to avoid it. World of hurt. Understood. In gold! I'll take a Pathetic! Tap the seal! Understood. Ha, Ready? Ha, Infinite ha, power. Take a closer look. No be thy strength. Ha, ha, ha. Meteor storm. Ready? Tap the seal. I'll take a closer no look. Way. Hey. Ha, Ready? Not too bad. Tap this. So annoying. I'll take a closer look. No way. Look. I call upon the hour. Take be thy strength. I summon thee. Come, shadow. Ha, ha. <laughs> Understood. Ha, ha. Ready? I'll take a close look. Ten power. Grant me thy strength. Ready? Meteor storm. Ten I'll take a look. Man, that was pathetic. Hey, chicken. Well, two Joan. Still don't have that mastered. Really? Really? There's no way around it. You're gonna regret this. Gotcha. Ha, ha, ha. No way. Infinite ha, ha, ha. Seal. I'll take a closer look. Don't ready? Ha, ha. Tap the seal. Gotcha. I'll take a closer look. Uh, Infinite power. Ready? Grant me thy strength. Uh, 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 Meteor storm. Uh, uh, ah. Ready? Tap the seal. Uh, uh, ready? Tap the seal. Uh, beast. Was that a bit too much? A little bit, Rain, a little bit. Okay, flying. Man, that was the first time I've ever flown between two worlds. Although we wound up falling, there's actually insufficient energy, so that couldn't be helped. Yeah, I really want to fly again, but I guess that really isn't the time for that. Yes, we need to hurry. While we're over here talking about flying. The do origin origin earth. Dude, they make it where you can't go past them. You're gonna understood. Ready? Tap the seal. Closer look. Infinite powers. Ready? Be thy strength. Seal. Meteor storm. Ready? Tap the seal. 
Ready? Understood. Tap my seal. <clears throat> I'll take a closer look. Infinite power. Ready? Rant me the seal. strength. Ha, ha. Meteor storm. There we go. All talk, no action. And we made a beef stew. Hopefully that was the last. Yeah. Made all of our beef stew we needed. I'll try making some of the pal palea. Palea. This is gonna be a piece of cake. Ready? Ready? Ray! The source of heaven, earth, and everything in between. The ruler of all. Light, don't bother me. I summon thee. Come, origin. Are you ready? Ready? Tap my seal. Ready? Infinite powers. Grant me thy strength. Monic. Oh, over already? Yep. Don't give up. Ooh, that was close. What's wrong, Lloyd? Oh, nothing. Just I hurt people of Azalea. And this time I couldn't protect Claude either. I thought I'd gotten a little stronger, but now I think I haven't progressed at all. Lloyd, you've always tried to do your best that you could. You didn't give up, and now we've made it all the way to Tethiala. You're not like the other humans. And so that's why I like you, Lloyd. Thanks, Genus. Okay, then we'll come all the way here and all. We've come all the way here and all. We're not going to give up now. We're going to go find a way to save Colette and the world. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. You're gotcha. Understood. Ready? Tempest Ooh. Infinite I'll take Powers! A closer look. Grant me Beast. my strength! Tempest Meteor Storm! I'll take a closer look. All talk, no action. Additional gold, and we made the Pelea. Alright. Ah, sweet. Angel Eudrasiel. The angel that appeared in the Tower of Salvation, he was unbelievably powerful. Yes, I sense a power unlike anything we've faced so far. Even I thought we were going to die that time. Eudrasiel, that's what Kratos called him. Eudrasiel, huh? Ho ho! Hey, cool orbit. Heart of Fire. Whoa. Hey, by the way, where are we going? What the? You said... You're the one who said let's go. I thought you knew where you were going. How'd I know? I'm from Silverod. Oh, yes, of course. I'm sorry. Malatiko, the Imperial City, the center of Tethiala. The city where the King of Tethiala resides. Is it far from here? Not that far, just north of here. Well, I'll take it, huh? Alright, let's go up there. Alright. Tethiala's Chosen. Hey, what's Tethiala's, Tethiala's Chosen of Mana like? Oh, well, to sum him up in one word. Huh? He's an idiot. Huh? Well, you'll see for yourself. This is gonna be a Got piece of cake. Ha, ha. No way! Ready? Ha, ha. Ha, ha. Ha, ha. Grant me thy strength! Ha, ha. Ready? Tap the seal! Get no way! Meteor storm! Ha, ha. Ready? Ha, ha. Tap the seal! Ready? Tap the seal! Ha, ha. Ready? Infinite Ray. powers! Ready? Grant me thy Tap strength! The seal. Ha, ha. There we go. I was just warming up. We got some more fine pellets. All right, cooking. Still not there. 
Hey, a misty robe. I always go for a robe, but when I do, I go for the misty robe. Grr. Yoshi, what are you upset about? I assume he's upset about the crash. I'm sorry, Noshi. Grr. Hey, I'm trying to apologize. Grr. Fine, whatever. No supper for you tonight, you hear me? Wine. I don't even know how you got Noshi on the thing with you. Alright, so this is Tetheala. Kinda in the middle of nowhere right here. We're gonna go south for now. Kratos, our enemy. Can't believe he really was our enemy. Kratos? Yes, I think he seemed to know too much, but... As we finally went ahead with a journey of regeneration, he was just looking at us the whole time. I wonder if the things he said, especially Lloyd. I felt a gentleness in his words he spoke to you. Kratos, gentle, you've got to be kidding. Still, it's true, it's hard to believe that the things he said to us after what we saw the Exosphere manufacturing at the Asgard Ranch were spoken by a cold-hearted angel of Krushix. The way he... Then why did he take Colette? I don't know. Right, all we know is his goals and ours are not the same. Yeah. Oh, hey, chest. Super pellets. Whoa, whoa. It looked like there was something there. so hard to see anything. There is a thing over here. I saw it. For a split second. It's over there. You know, they say when you're in Tetheala, do Tetheala things. Sigh. Don't know, don't want to know, or what's wrong, Professor? I don't understand. Picking exactly according to the recipe that Genus gave me, but it's not going well. Oh, it's your wacky cooking. What do you mean, wacky? Heh <laughs> heh. But if you're still following Genus's recipe, it should turn out a bit, a little better. I guess I shouldn't have tried to put my own spin on it. Spin? Well, for instance, cakes. Cakes is sweet no matter who bakes it, right? So wouldn't a spicy cake be a breakthrough? I think I know why your cooking is dangerous. Oh, so close. Still ran into somebody. You're in for a world of hurt. Ready? Ted the seal! Infinite power! Ready? Infinite power! Ready? 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 We do want to try to get everybody. The worst cook is Rain. By far.
Whoa. Yo. There's a little hamlet looking castle thing. House of Guidance. I know it's a bit weird a place like this, but would you like to trade? Hey, I'll take a grab bag. Sun charm. Come again. Hello, this is the House of Guidance. Well, hello to you. I'm a cook, not a chef. Take note of that. Welcome to the House of Guidance. The northwest of here you'll find the Imperial City of Melotico, but that place just doesn't suit me none. Ah, are you wearing interesting clothing? Ah, let's take a rest. 600 gal, dang. Talk about inflation. Hey, silver on prices, and why do y'all use the same uh, money system? Six hundred gal, dang. Lloyd confesses his love. Hello. We're in Tethiala, can you tell? It's no use, she doesn't respond at all. Maybe you should try telling her you love her. What, why? Oh, you're so dense, stop asking questions and just try it. Um, uh, I love you. Oh, well, I guess if that's all it took to bring her back to normal, we wouldn't be coming all the way here to Tethiala. Genus, ow. As a note, here I love at games, we love all of you. Alright, that looks like a big old city. We're not gonna go there just yet. No. We're gonna go over here to the bridge. I like the music. Where are you going? Mele Taco Mele Taco is further south. All right, I don't know my way around here. Well, fine. We're still gonna go explore. And how often do you get to go to another world? I mean, it's a human nature. Explore everything you can and fart into the wind. No other talking points around here? I do have the bad feeling that being the chosen of Silveron's group, coming to Tetheala to go meet the person who put out a hit on me, it's not gonna turn out quite so well. Well, let's go to Melodakio. Sorry, but I'm gonna part ways with you here. What? Why? Have you forgotten? I was trying to kill Colette. I had to report my failure to the chief. The chief of person in the city. I'm from Mizihu. The people of Mizihu were chased from this land. We all live in hiding. If you're gonna make the report, or are you gonna be all right? Don't worry about that. Anyways, I'd like to deliver this. I'd like you to deliver this letter for me. Please give this to the king in the castle of Tetheala. Tell him that Sheena of Mizu will grant you an audience right away. 
The king wants to kill Colette, right? Are you sure this is going to be all right? In order to stop that, I've written the details of everything that happened. And requested that they heal Colette. Help heal Colette. I see. Thank you. No. You don't have to thank me. It's nothing. Don't mention it. The Imperial Research Academy is under the control of the royal family. There isn't any other way. That's all. Are you embarrassed? You're funny, Sheena. Shut up. I'm going now. Oh, we'll see you again, right? Oh, we might meet again. We might not. Then let's not say goodbyes yet. Yeah, see you again. Yeah, see you again someday. She takes us to another planet and then leaves. Tethiola, the flourishing room. Tethiola is so amazing. Yeah, there's all sorts of things I've never seen in Silver on. It's supposed it's expected in the flourishing world. As long as the world is flourishing, Silveron will be in decline. Oh, yeah, you're right. But how in the world did things wind up like this? Or like that? Yes, it's a fascinating question. Mm. Alright, so we're over here. I'm looking around before I just... Go in. Nothing for us to do in there. Alright. Looks like a hidden path in to Tethel. All is melee take Oh, there are dogs on this side too. What? And she used to love dogs. Haha, that's a violent young lady there. It's marvelous. Who in the world was that man? This is Tethiel's Imperial City of Melitakio. Would you like me to explain the different areas? Yes. If you climb these stairs and head straight, you'll find the Royal Castle and the Upper Class Quarters. The area to the right is called the Slums, where those who have no money and no home live. The area we are in now is the City Core. There are shops and Coliseum and an inn for travelers. I think that about covers it, I think. Uh, slums or shops or city. Imperial City Melitaco is completely surrounded by castle walls, so we can live our lives without worry. Welcome, travelers. Well, welcome to you, good sir. Hey, kitty. Sorry, I'm busy right now. Where are the syrup bottles and the flare bottles? Can't do anything if you don't stay alive. It's a good idea to stock up on gels. Now, if you have business, talk to the receptionist. Welcome to the Cat's Exploration Team. Do you need help with something? Yes. Uh, monsters. How much do you want to spend? An insane amount. Item shop. Fourteen. And twenty. 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 Maxed out. Twenty. Twenty. Poison. Perilous. Yeah. Pretty much what we just needed to do. Hey, child. The gate closes at night, so we can't play outside the city. So this is our playground. All seam is above here. Quite uncomfortable here. There aren't many quiet places in the city. I cannot go above to the Colosseum? Gentlemen, what are you looking for around here? Everything like you've never seen the city before. I'm well, sorry, is this really your first time here? I thought in your general direction, so. Finally arrived in Melitaco. Walking from city to city isn't easy. The hustle and bustle of the city is tiring. 
Welcome, we have a room ready for you in just a minute. Welcome to Sancta Cassius. One night, 300. Yeah. A little bit more reasonable than the little hamlet in the middle of nowhere. Please take care. Please take care and always wear fresh underwear. Greetings, you're most welcome here. Just come in here and burn down a room and walk out. I had a flight, fight with my husband, he ran away from my house. No! There was a young lady we needed to talk to. Mom and Dad had a fight, it's been a lot of trouble. Alright. <coughs> If you go out from here, you'll find the Elemental Research Laboratory, where they study summon spirits and things related to them. Welcome to the slums, I guess. This area is called the slums. We'll come back. Kind of depressing music. This is the Elemental Research Lab Laboratory. Research on summon spirits and mana take place in this basement. And not go through the door? Not go through the door. There you got bugs. The power produced by summon spirit should be essentially the same as mana. Then even if the mana were to be lost from this world, if we were able to use the power of summon spirits, we may be able to preserve the world. Ah, since we stopped using the man-made summon spirit Corinne as an experimental subject, our summon spirit research has stagnated. And after Corinne, we failed repeatedly in creating any other artificial ones. What to do? Burn the place down. Thanks to Sheena and Corinne, our research leapt forward. But now that they're gone, we've come to a complete standstill. Scientist trying to play God. I mean, I know it's dreary, but why do you have to put dreary, depressing music with it, too? They say you should not fear trouble and work hard when you're young, but it's best to avoid it once you get older. You never know what the fortune will bring. I heard there's a cute flower seller in here, but I guess it's just a false rumor. Thought I shouldn't have gone gambling. No. Nothing good comes out of that. It really doesn't. I'm a traveler with no sense of direction. I got lost and somehow wound up here. Woof. Oh my, we don't usually get visitors around here. This area is off limits, it's my secret base. Just burn the kid's hair. Alright, to the next level. Settle down, my darling honeys. Hi there, my little cool beauty. Are you hurt? Well, Master Zellos himself has deigned to speak to this girl, and yet look how she acts! Just look at her. It's not even festival time, and yet she's dressed up in an angel costume. How stupid are you? Can you believe the nerve of this hag? What did you say? 
Genus, let it go. She's obviously never looked in a mirror. What did you say? You're all behaving like children. Now, now, settle down. Are you upset, my little angel? You know, I bet you're as cute as a button when you smile. That was a surprise. You sure are strong, my little angel. You certainly startled me. Well, who are you? No offense, but I'm not interested in talking to guys. I hate this guy already. Ooh, what's your name, beautiful? Give me your name and I'll give you mine. Hey, you copied Lloyd. Mm, now that I've heard someone else say it, Sounds kind of arrogant. Oh, my, you don't know me? Well, well, I guess I still have a ways to go. <laughs> Master Zelos, let's go! Oh, yes, yes, of course. Well then, I'll see you again. My lovely lady, my cute little angel, and uh, you other people. What was that all about? What an ass. He was grinning like an idiot the entire time. What's wrong with that guy? He had an X-sphere on him. What? No way! So that's how he reacted so fast. Just who is that guy? That guy is Zelos, Tepeala's Chosen. I came with Grandma. Oh, it's an angel. I brought my grandson on a walk with me. No, you're already dressed as an angel. Getting a little ahead of ourselves, are we? Repellos? What do you got? Welcome to the armor shop. You got some elfin protectors. Some druid cloaks. Hey, some more misty robes. Another straw hat. The striped ribbons. Omega shields. Claw gauntlets. Lapis lazul bracelets. The heavy boots. Armors in Malateka still is exceptional in quality. Don't you think you should get some new armor too? We got it, we need to put it on. I mean heck, right now we're using... Oh wait. We're using all cursed weaponry. Oh, I'm Genus. I don't want to play as Genus. Yeah, that's better. And while we're here, let's look at everyone's Cyclone, Ground Dasher, Thunderblade, Indignation, Meteor Storm. Three, three, seven, six. All right. On our way. What is this? If you're going to the Coliseum, how about purchasing a new weapon? I wonder how they could stay in business when all that many people need weapons. I'm not dissatisfied with the weapons they issue us. Customization shop. Weapon shop. We're gonna buy as many and as much of everything as we can. And 
cards of fire. Some cards of earth. Some freshetta? Guess what that says? Thanks, pal. Thank you. Those who possess fighting skills feel the urge to test them. I never lost the first match in the Coliseum. Zamela Taka Coliseum. Warriors enter the stage for the fame to test their skills and various other abilities. I'm in charge of first aid. I can even revive the dead with my bandages. This is the Colosseum. Combat has more than just muscle strength. I compete with the quality of my attacks. It is forbidden to draw weapons outside the Colosseum. We appreciate your cooperation. Magicians have a hard time with singles matches. Your spells keep getting interrupted. I wonder if there's any way to solve that. Intensive trading will... Build a heart that does not falter before the terror of real combat. Only participants in the fight are permitted through here. Sorry, interest registration. It, this round is already over today. So, we're going to have to come back here and test our fortitude. Shall we continue up? This area is the upper class quarter. It's the place where the rich live. Are you sure you're in the right place? I guarantee you I have more money than everyone up here on this game. I have to tend the garden. If you don't take good care of flowers, they won't bloom nicely. It's not wanting to go over somewhere else yet. Let's see what's over here. This is the Martel Cathedral, it's the largest temple in Tetheala. Alright. We'll go over here, then we'll go to the cathedral, then we'll go up to the castle. I presume... Travelers, I presume. This isn't a place for commerce. If you came here by accident, then leave now. Screw you, dude. No need to be a dick. Not time for the dinner party yet. To be or not to be, that is the question, huh? Kind of an overused line. Romeo, where, where art thou, Romeo? I am tired of this game, too. I'm in night. Maintaining order in the city is one of our duties. Since the king fell ill, they have stopped holding dinner parties. Every day I'm dreadfully boring. I don't know what else to do. I have a terrible problem. I have too much money, I just don't know what to do. Help out the people. That's what you do. Bark. My father is a famous musician. Oh, are you a guest? Normally I'd play a song, but unfortunately the piano needs tuned. I'm still constantly being scolded by my teacher, but I won't give up. There's a lot going on in this city. This... my kin is missing. Uh, oh, I missed a door. May I help you? May I help you? A nice place you got here. Sure be a shame to do an upper decker in your toilet. I mean, hey. This is the castle of Tetheola. 
Who are you people? We want to meet the king. His majesty is ill and is not granting audiences. Now that you know, please leave. No, we have to see him. Sure you do, but until his majesty's will, there's nothing that can be done. The Church of Mortel is preparing a prayer ritual to pray for his majesty's recovery. To try asking the priest and church to ensure that he gets well as soon as possible. Your shift's up. Alright. Guess we'll have to go to the church. How do you come in from the side? There's nowhere to come in from. Unless you jumped up the guardrail. This is the Church of Martell. Series off limits to unauthorized personnel. Our mother, who art thou in heaven? Welcome to the Church of Martell. So, Prisea, the prayers are to take place in the royal chambers. Please carry the sacred wood to the castle. Yes. She's cute. That girl he called Persea has an X here too. Is that a standard custom over here? Yeah, she's really cute. You're not listening at all, are you? You mentioned prayers. Are you praying for the recovery of the king? Yes, the Chosen and the Pope will pray before his majesty and receive assistance of Martel. You said the prayers will take place in the royal chambers, right? Yes, that is correct, but okay, thanks. You guys have figured out how we're going to see the king. But what are you going to do? We'll pretend to carry the sacred wood and sneak in. I thought you'd say that, but how are you going to get the sacred wood? Let's have that Prisea help us. What? Really? I agree. That's a good plan. Let's do that. Well, Alright, let's try talking to her at least. Then catch up to her. Genus has a crush. Welcome to the Church of Martell. Well then, I'll let you get to work. The sacred wood goes to Altamira. You can do it after your current job is done. Understood. The plan is right on schedule. I must report to Lord Rodile. Hey! Hang on a sec! Um... Prisea! Could we have a moment of your time? I'm Lloyd. This is Colette and Rain. Uh, I'm Genus. Hey, Genus, why are you all flushed? Would you let us help you carry the sacred wood? W wait! I'm sorry, I know this is a bit strange, but please hear us out. The truth is, we have a letter we wish to give to the king. Our friend's life depends on it. But we have a problem because the king is sick and refuses to see anyone. It would really help us out if we could carry it for you. Uh, are you listening? Understood. Um, Prisea? Please carry that. Oh, okay. Leave it to us. Oh my... Wait, wait a minute. Gah, this thing is heavy. I've lost all confidence as a man. Me too. Anyway, let's follow her. Alright, as she leaves her secret with there, we're going to call it an episode. Thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section down below. Tell me what you think of Tetheala. We are all people from Silveron in a whole different world. So this will be interesting. I hope you enjoy and have a wonderful day. God bless. Peace.